Good morning. Well, you just missed my second tea break of the day. That was tea and another slice of delicious lemon drizzle cake, homemade. Very nice. This is a vegetable patch that was put in with raised beds earlier this year during lockdown and filled with a fantastic combination of compost and rotted manure and topsoil that had been graded. They've really, really made a good effort of this. They wanted to get it right the first time. Obviously struggled with the insects like everyone did this year, so lots of Enviromesh, but it's worked for them. It's been a bit of an experiment this year. Obviously a lot of the beds are clear, but these were very, very productive. As you can see here, there's a fennel. That's bulking up nicely there, almost ready. I've got some parsnips in there that have been frosted a little bit, although they can probably do with a bit more. In there we've got some sprouts, we've got the remaining cauliflower, um, and then the rest is really there's leeks here. This is leek elephant, living up to its name, it's doing rather well. They've had a few already, so they're very nice. There's a little sage in there. Um, the beans were in here, so I've just left the roots in there while I've cleared it. And there were herbs up against the wall, but they didn't do too well this year, so we're going to try something new, maybe different varieties next year. Possibly they got a bit hot, really. Um, oh, that's quite sheltered in here, it's not too bad. And this is the wall bed. I thought I'd show you this. Fantastic. I mean, 10 out of 10 for real effort here. These are apricots, went in this year, and they're determined not to lose them. I have let them know that obviously if it gets too warm over winter it might be worth opening up, letting the air in a little bit because I don't want to end up with a load of insects under there, nibbling away. And a couple of artichokes that were tiny. Again, they protected those, they're doing really, really well. I did get blown over a little by the wind this year, so we're going to stake those next year. But all in all, I think it's doing rather well. I'm quite pleased with this. So next stage, we're going to get some well-rotted horse manure, get that on the top and then cover it with cardboard to let it over winter. Anyway, really exciting discovery of the day. Um, I love some strange things, absolutely love compost, love spiders, and I love fungus. And look at this, it's a really good find. Wow, bird's nest fungus, so excited. I've never actually seen these in the flesh. But aren't they cute? Can you see them? Just see, oh, you can't really see yet why they're called bird's nest fungus, because they have got little eggs in them. I'm going to leave them there for my customer to have a look at. It must have been something in the compost. Not entirely sure of the conditions. I'm not all that au fait with it, just have an interest. So there we go, another lovely morning. Long way it stay this way, although I fear there's rain coming. Well, enjoy your day. See you later.